is Xiao Sun Yang. Uh, I'm a social professor in the Bournemouth University. So in 2008, uh, I think we got a team together, uh, lead the start from the Professor Jian Zhang. He established a team, including three uh, consultant doctors, surgeons from the uh, Royal Bournemouth Hospital and the Pool Hospitals. So including our PG student, some research staff, we built a kind of a colorectal surgeon simulator. Here's kind of a training system because the real uh, kind of laparoscopic surgery is very complex. So the surgeon need to look at the screen and manipulate down there. So they kind of need, need the doctors need to imagine what happened down in the patient kind of belly. So it's a very complex process and uh, need really long kind of learning curves. So for the, we use the VR kind of AR kind of technologies to try to simulate that one. So the patient can <coughs> simulate on the virtual patient. So definitely is a low, low risk and the, the doctors can keep trying this a lot of times and there's no harm. So, so far the three kind of consultant surgeons uh, help us to give a lot of tests. And so far the test is based on two things. One is the, <coughs> the kind of appearance, how realistic is the rendering. The second part is the false feedback, how it feels when you touch that, uh, the kind of patient, the kind of internal organs. We hope to cooperate with some kind of companies because what we're doing, what we have done so far is just research. We hope some companies will help us to turn into the commercialized stage. So maybe hire some software, uh, software developers to wrap it into a software and including some kind of even user studies. So that's to kind of make it a really complete product so the surgeon can use. Yeah. Actually, that's the, it's the best part of this product. Yes, we got the technical people, the computer science background people, and we got some kind of like the physics background, know that what happened in the real life for the kind of soft tissue information. You also need some knowledge from the medical knowledge. So we could combine all this together. So that's the reason we need a whole team of people to work together to make this work.